Carol was the creator of the uh, Entertainment of the Green Ops back in 1981. And she ran it for five, six, seven years, and she turned it over to the uh, the Recreation Department, and they've been running it ever since. And Carol died last year in, 19, in 2016, and we decided to we uh, created a memorial for her. So the town okayed it, and uh, today's the day they're going to do it. This is a very hairy bench. It's eight feet long. It takes about four guys to carry it outside, and they're going to leave it out all summer. And then in the winter, they bring it back inside so they can use it into the, in the rec center all winter long. Henry of Carroll for the concerts on the green, and it's coming from the Belmont. And the corporation wants to thank you very much for your donation. The donation is coming from the Dell Men's Club of Pembroke. And we're doing it in memory of one of our dull men's wives that died, Carol Norris. And we're doing it for the bench that they're putting in. And that's why we're doing eight and a hundred dollar check. It, she really brought a lot of entertainment to the town because they didn't have anything way back then. And it's really nice for the people to get out, you know, and enjoy the night, which tonight's a hot night, but it gets a little cooler and the entertainment's good, so. She started that, and that's why we're honoring her. Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, my name is Lou Stone. I'm here today uh, to welcome you to the dedication of a bench in memory of Carol Norse. Uh, I bring greetings from the Board of Selectmen. Uh, we're very happy to announce that this bench is here today to be dedicated. Uh, Carol uh, and her family uh, live on Oak Street, and they were neighbors of mine for many, many years. And it's a privilege for me to be here today. Uh, I'd also like to say that today is the day of the 35th anniversary of uh, what you are here to hear tonight is uh, the concert on the green, which was something that Carol pioneered and got installed here in Pembroke for many thousands of people to enjoy over the years. Uh, I'd also just like to thank, on behalf of the Board of Selectmen, our Recreation Director, Susan Roach, and we have our town clerk here today, Mary Ann Smith. Thank you for coming, and thank you for the work that you've done to put this on today. Uh, Carol's daughter, Lynn, is here and uh, she would like to say a few words to you before we dedicate the bench. Thank you for coming. Lynn? Hi, my name is Lynn Sanda and um, I grew up in Pembroke along with my brother and we lived on Oak Street for, and for just until we got married, but I haven't been back here in a long time, but it looks pretty much the same. It looks great. Um, my mom was a very humble person and she probably wouldn't like any of this fanfare or anybody paying attention to what she did, but I think it's important that we all realize the amount of time that she put into volunteering to make a free concert series for the town of Pembroke and surrounding towns too. Um, we're very proud to honor her memory and acknowledging the amazing work she did for the town of Pembroke and all of it as a volunteer. The impact she made here by founding the Entertainment on the Green in 1982 has been enjoyed for 35 years and we hope that it will be for many more years to come. So thank you for joining us here today to celebrate a wonderful woman who I had the privilege of calling mom. So we're going to go over and reveal the bench. Right back in. Yeah. Here we go. 